Hey everybody! Do I have any of my late owls on here with me tonight? Trying to pull it up on my phone. Tonight I'm trying something new with doing my video. I'm using my my webcam instead of my actual phone. So I'm going to see if this kind of helps with not getting blurry. So when you hop on, how about tell me, hey, let me know how this um, how this picture is. And if you can hear me good. Um, trying to see. The picture looks way brighter to me on my end. Hey, Christine and Miss Linda. So how's the view? I feel like, I don't know, the camera's this way. Then I've got my picture this way. So I feel like I'm constant. I'm not looking into the camera. But um, it's kind of weird. Um, let me see. I might can pull y'all a little bit closer. Seems like y'all are kind of far away. Let me see. I don't want to knock anything down. So let's see if that helped. Um, let's move it that way. All right, right now. I don't want to touch it and mess with it too much. So it, now there's a big delay. Hey, Cindy and Natalie and Brenda. How are you ladies doing? How do y'all like this? Is the picture good? Is the picture good? So tonight I'm going to be painting a round sign and I'm going to make it look like a watermelon, y'all. And we're going to put um, maybe like happy summer on it. So we're going to see. So y'all just come on, say hey to me. Let me know what y'all are up to late tonight. Trying to get it situated. Okay, why is it not scrolling? Hey, Miss Sheila and Aunt Pat. Hey, Melinda. Haley. Hey, clear and bright. Sounds good. Thank you, Shannon. Just what I wanted to hear. Much clearer now than earlier. Okay, that's great, Natalie. Hey, Debbie. Thank you so much. Linda says, pictures good, good. Hey, awesome. Oh, Amanda says, I sign up for your group. Yay, Amanda. I'm super excited to have you in there. Hey, Miss Teresa, everything looks clear and bright. Could you zoom in some? Um, when I just pulled in some, did that help any, Miss Teresa? Hey, Karen. And see, Miss Wanda, so let's get started because it is late. Hello, Debbie from Kentucky. Uh, so I could probably zoom in my phone. I meant the camera. I can actually zoom in, but I can like move the the um, thing a little bit further. Drinking wine, watch. Oh, Angie, you got a good idea, girl. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Jesse, looking crystal crystal clear. Okay, all right. Yes, Natalie, I've never done this before, so Tammy. Oh, Miss Judy, hello, from Mexico. So, this is another trial and error, y'all. Um, I don't even know what color I'm going to use. I'm not, you know, watermelon, I'm going to use probably some red, some pink, some greens, black and white. Um, hey, Christy, what you making? It's kind of, I'm going to make a um, watermelon round door hanger. I haven't made one of these yet, but I'm going to try my best to make one tonight. Picking up my beans. I think I'm going to use maybe palm leaf and sublime. Hey, Miss Jody. Clear watching, listening to you while sewing my mask. Oh, Jerry. Hey, everybody. All right, so let's go with, let's go with maybe the tomato head. So we got pine leaf, sublime, tomato red. I think I'm going to put some on this tomato red, y'all. Maybe some fusion. Flowers on the wall look so good. Thank you so much. Um, I don't really like fuchsia. 
Um, we cut bright magenta. We go bright magenta. Let's see. See how that works. Okay, so let's get started. I'm probably going to use a brush tonight. Hey, everybody, did you get your Cricut? Shelly, um, it's supposed to be here tomorrow. I did get my vinyl today. So it's like everything except for the actual Cricut. I got my my hats the other day. Then I got my vinyl yesterday. So maybe tomorrow my Cricut will be here. I, I sure so. Hey, Yolanda. All right. Um, I'm going to kind of draw out well, kind of like where I want my rim or the rhyme of the watermelon to be. Um, let's see. Maybe I can do it. And I'm going to do it kind of wiggly. I don't want it to be straight. Give it kind of a funky, whimsy kind of look going on. Just to make it fun. And it makes it easier too when you're trying to paint it. My nose is wanting to run. Terrible allergies. Your crap would look so pretty. Thanks so much, Marilyn. Hey, Trina from Pennsylvania. You're so kind and an inspiration. Oh, Donna, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. Miss seeing you lately. Love your workspace. Thank you, Leanne. All right. Let's put some. I think I might need. I think this is about the biggest brush I have. I have a huge brush here, and I really don't want to use that one. So I guess I'm going to use this one inch flat tip brush. And we're going to start adding the red to here. Hey, Miss Betty. So y'all let me know if it stays clear. I wish I could get you a little bit more higher and kind of down. Maybe I can. I'll just give it a little bit kind of. You love a little bit. I can make all kinds of different things. You will love working with vinyl. Teresa, I'm going to talk to you while I kind of moved up. See if we can get it adjusted a little bit, a little bit closer anyway. I actually wanted the silhouette. I've heard so many people say it was, you can just do so much more. Let me see how that is real quick. But I was also reading, and a lot of people were saying that it was, um, it was a lot harder to figure out. And being that I'm new, all right, we're adjusting. Let me see. I uh, decided to go with the easiest one that everybody was saying was, well, the everyone was saying was the easiest. So, um, okay, that needs to get down a little bit more. I'm scared if I get close and start moving, then may start getting too blurry. Let me see. I might move. Let me see if I can move this just a little bit. Y'all won't be able to see me, but that's okay. <coughs> My hand to be chopped off. But I think that's going to be better right there for y'all to see. So let's make sure. Is that a little bit better, y'all? My voice is breaking up. You're breaking up. Oh, no. Okay, well, let's. And let's roll with it and let's see. Um, let's hope it works. Okay. How about the picture though? Is the picture still good? As long as the picture is good, I think we're good. I hope. I see my shadow today, y'all, and I was about to pull it out. I was about to roll on out of here. I'm trying to decide between the cricket and the silhouette, too. Karen, I am not a tech savvy person at all. So, trust me, the bigger the cricket out, then the cricket's pretty easy to use. So, as soon as I get my hands on my cricket, as soon as it gets here, if I can figure out, I will definitely let you know, everybody know, 
if it's easy to use or if it's hard. Or I'm going to just go ahead and get my outline first. Picture is good. Picture is great. Okay. Because that's what I'm going to be with. I didn't want to get anything that I couldn't use. And none of my family has so it. They all have the Cricut. So I, I knew I was, I'm going to have help with Cricut. That's one reason I went with the Cricut as well. But once I figure that out, I would actually look at the, the silhouette too. So I want to be greedy and have it all. Nah. But if the cricket does good, I probably won't even mess with having, you know, trying to get nothing else. We shall see. Okay, now we can work on, I'm like splashing red paint everywhere. Now I'm just going to start filling in the inside of this. I think I'm just going to squirt some on here. Hey, Jessica. Am I still going in and out, y'all, or am I pretty good? Like my voice. Am I still good? The dogs is outside barking at something. Lord have mercy. It's a little bit scary up here about my life, y'all. It really is. Scary. <laughs> like something going to come through the window and, and grab me and get me. All right, so we're just putting a, a solid coat of um on here. And again, this is the tomato red by Derek. Bring it this way. Chase, Stacy, Choppy, and L. Okay. Saying it's Choppy, so it's, it's perfect. So I'm just going to roll with it, y'all. I'm so sorry. I'm really going to get on my husband this weekend. He's got to get my thing up here. Can't be having no bad videos. Can't be having no bad videos, y'all. What's the whole point of having this business? Is to teach and have a good service with videos and um, not having that really hurts me. So, got to get it straight. Got to Alrighty, so with this, it don't look like I'm going to put another coat on here. We're going to smooth all that paint out. So, yeah, if you have not heard, my inside is open. And if you don't know what in the world the inside scoop is, that's actually my membership group that I have um, where I teach other creative ladies how to cut and paint their own wooden door hangers. I provide them with two templates per month, and I show them how to use a jigsaw and cut out, and then I do a tutorial with them on getting it. We got some clumps, and we also do a craft together. We have guests come in and just different things. They either teach us like some kind of technique, or they will actually paint. Um, an actual door hanger with us. This month for May, we're going to be working on hand lettering, and we got a guest coming in talking with us about that. And our guest, um, we got from Crack Ginger Boutique Paint Parties and More coming in. She's going to be showing us a design this month. So, a really full month of lots and lots of fun stuff. Are you using the microphone from the computer or the microphone? Oh, Christine, it's the microphone from the computer. Let me see. What did y'all say? Oh, 
All right, Jessica, I see where you said, how are you like your space? And then uh, someone replied, I thought the same. Looks like a pizza. Tell Joy to get to getting that on uh, WeBoost. Natalie, all he's got to do is bring it upstairs. He's going to have to like, drill a hole through the wall and mound it on the outside of the house. And, and so, um, oh, if, it's, if it was something I could do, trust me, I will be doing it. But, but I don't think I can do all that. I'll probably break a leg up and climb it up on top of the house. The boat there. Uh, Susan, it is 30 months a month. And I got a thing of water. I want to use a different thing of water for it. My paint. I'm for this red. There's like a bug in there, y'all. I left this work in here last night, and now there's a bug in there. Thirty-seven dollars a month. It is a curry, but of course you can cancel any time that you do. I'm gonna give this a quick little drive. Now that's a slice of water. I know, Debbie. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm hoping it will be better. At least the view is better, right? At least you can see it is clear. Okay, Mary, that might help, but I think it's my connection. Oh, Natalie, you're so sweet. All right, so that's not completely dry, but. Let me rinse my brush out. Well, some people say that anyway, so some may love that my my voice is not kind of not on um, coming through. <laughs> hey, Miss Lynn. All right, so now I'm going to take my bright magenta, and we're going to do some dots. Let me see. Do I want to do dots or do I just want to do wiggle? Yeah, let's do dots. We're Has gotten so clunky, y'all. I've got clunky paint all in. Like every day on paint bottle I pick up. All right, I'm just gonna start maybe like right here. I'm gonna do kind of like some big, big dots, y'all. I want this to be really fun and just whimsy. Um. I'm trying to decide if I want to add that dot's like the biggest dot. So let's go ahead and make these dots over here a little bit bigger so they can all kind of be the same size. There we go. Now this one needs to be a little bit bigger. We're going to try to make it bigger going off the other side so that it won't get too close to this. Perfect. There we go. Hey, Miss Glenda, you're breaking up on my end. Miss Pat, I know. Mine do the same thing. <laughs> I know. I'm so sorry. As long as the picture is good, um, I'm good. So I know the, the audio with the computer don't really work. Although it gives me a lot better picture, the audio don't work. So I don't know. I'm so sorry. I tried. I tried. I tried. Ooh, I just got somebody else that signed up for the group. I just seen it come through. Y'all are amazing. I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Even the ones that don't join, I appreciate your support. Because whether or not you know it or not, just by being on this live with me and commenting and talking me y'all are helping me out more than you know so even if you don't join you are helping and i so appreciate it 
so, so much. Try not to get no more of those clumps. And I got one. Okay, I'm going to see if I can get some without the clumps. Yay! Hey, Christine. Hey, Shannon from North Carolina. Welcome. Y'all see the clunk? It is awful. Look at that. It's terrible. Oh, goodness. I love apple paint, y'all. That's what I use most of the time. And I love deco art. It's just so much easier for me to get my hands on. But it is so bad about clunk. Well, well, I'm so happy for you. Oh, oh, you're so sweet. Marilyn, she says I jumped up for the email scoop. You're awesome, girl. Yo, we're going to have some fun in there this month. I promise you. I promise you. Right now, when you go in there, you're probably like, oh, Lord. Because me and Miss, um, Miss Christine, Christine Smith, you see her on the live here. She with everybody, too. She is my lovely A. And we decided to kind of do something a little bit different in there. And so right now she's got a lot of stuff getting posted, getting it organized. So, but hopefully by the time everything starts for the month of May, we will have everything. The wall won't be jammed full of everything else. Okay, so I'm just kind of going and filling in. I think a dot should be to make it look like it's kind of coming off of the Tell you one thing. My husband better have my video straight up here by then. Or I might have a hissy fit. He gonna be divorcing me, y'all. Okay. All right. All right. So some more coming. Looking like it's coming off like maybe up here. Hey, Georgia. Um. Oh, Mickey, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. Hey, Joanne. Hello, we from Washington State. Oh, Mary. Oh, Teresa, you're so sweet. My lady's in there. Oh, I can't complain at all about. The ladies that the good brought to me because they have been amazing, amazing. And they're on here and they support me and help me and I just love them to death. Okay, let's see. I think I need one right here. Like I said, y'all, this is a whimsy for melon. It's gonna be a fun one. My dot looks like it's going a little bit crazy there. Let me try to make it flip up a little bit more so it can, so it'll look more like a dot. Okay. I'm going to be putting a black, like a black outline around that anyway. All right. So there's the dot so far. See that? Everything's still clear with the picture. Hey, Anne. Hey, Trina. How are you doing? Oh, Rosemary. Thank you so much. Is it Rosemary or Rosemary? Say one if it's Rosemary or two if it's Rosemary. When do you go live in your group? Karen, it depends. Um, actually, I posted a video. I mean, not a video. I'm sorry. I posted a calendar. So everybody in here can kind of see how the inside scoop works. Down below on my wall. Somewhere. But, um, I've been trying to rotate it for mornings and afternoons because I know there's in there that works so i've been trying to do that a little bit um so if, if it's, i try to get try to stay kind of on the same day like if i do a tutorial on tuesday week then the next week if a tutorial's done then i do it that week i mean the tuesday on that week so is it a pizza patricia now this is going to be a watermelon girl it's going to be a Watermelon. Someone else said something earlier that looked like a <laughs> All right. So I'm going to start with my 
lime green. This is the apple barrel. Thank you, Jan. You're amazing. Thank you so much for sprinkling. It'll come out like a watermelon, I promise. When I'm doing it, you'll, you know it's a watermelon and not a pizza. This right here is about to confirm that it's not a pizza. We're going to have something going on. Okay. I'm not going to stress too much over trying to get it exactly on my little line here simply because I'm actually going to put black on that too. So. Is my girl Jessica on here? Jessica, I'm going to do some hand on this and you're going to be super proud of me because I have been working so hard and practicing at my lettering and it is so much better than it used to be. I do get my edges on my door hangers, y'all, um, because I hand cut mine. So it's just raw wood around my edges. Is the pizza look kind of going away? Is it still looking like pizza? You want pizza now, Teresa? Oh, I'm sorry. Girl, you making me hungry. <laughs> Y'all, it's going to be a watermelon. Which watermelon do you make? Because I love me some watermelon. I love me some watermelon. Mercy, trying to calm your tail down. All right, we're going to tap on these edges real quick. And I've never painted one like this. I've painted one before, but I've never painted a round watermelon. And I had this cup. That was just sitting over there in my pile. So I said, you know what? I'm going to do a water. And make it like really whimsical. And then. It's kind of hard to, to move around when it's wet. Watermelon with salt. I see, Jessica, I'm the opposite. Now, I want. Watermelon, if it's sweet, I don't want no salt. I just want the whole watermelon. There are many people there that love salt on their worm. And that's weird because I love salt. I'm a, I love salt like crazy on my food. If that if that opens too salty, then um it's salty. It is salty. But Oh, dear Lord, y'all see what I'm doing? But I, I don't like salt on my watermelon for some reason. But everybody around me, they like salt too, Jessica, so you're not alone. Now you are. <laughs> I'm making everybody want watermelons. Hey, Patsy. Hey, Miss Sandy. That's the best way to eat watermelon. So, Miss Teresa agrees, Jessica, because she likes salt, too. <laughs> so, Miss Cindy don't like salt on hers, either. Yes, too. Watermelon would be so good right now. I know, is it? Watermelon helps you with your thirst, too. It's so juicy and so good. So yeah, y'all sprinkle the love for me. I will so appreciate that. All right, I'm just gonna lift this up, make sure I got all my edges. And I'm thinking I'm gonna have to come back around and do this one more time. Because I'm still seeing some of my wood in spots. I used to not, but my husband got me on it. Oh 
Where Jessica? Looks like pepperoni pizza. I want ice cold watermelon with a little bit of salt. All right, let's go and put one more cake on this rig, y'all. I got a little bit of red right there. We are gonna just just fine. I think it's going on all best. Is my audio still going out, y'all, or has it gotten better? Well, hey, Miss Faith, salt bring the flavor out. Thank you, Brandy. I appreciate you share, oh, sprinkling. And just, oh, you're amazing, girl. Amazing. All right. We're going to finish this green up really quick. I got a little sloppy right here. Let me see if I can fix this, y'all. I don't like the way sloppy I am right there. It's a little too sloppy. There we go. That fixed it. There's the green. I'm trying to point to the camera. I'm at my computer. My camera's over here, so let me try to get it. So there's the green around it. Your class of 2020 turned out great. Thank you so much, Beverly. Choppy and yes on the Let me show you, though. The color is really, really, really pretty. You can see it really, really better, like the color really pops on this if I can get it straight more than good <laughs> anyway I see the glitter on there now I got to put it on the pole and then on the the, the hat there see how it shines so I think it really turned out good too so that was a good call on the glitter y'all the ones that hit yesterday painting that what kind of brand she isn't this was a master's touch brush and it's an angular brush that I get from Hobby Lobby. It's one of my favorite brushes. I will grab an angle brush 99% of the time. Okay. Let's go. I'm going to get I'm gonna get this flat tip brush and I'm gonna go ahead while all the ones still wet. Thank you so much. You know, it'll be a pretty watermelon by the time I finish it because you are always I look so beautiful. I think, oh, Miss Marilyn, you are so, so sweet. <laughs> Miss Marilyn, I don't think I'm going to do any kind of shading on this one. I'm going to let this one roll. Um, but to be whimsy. All right, so with my. Um, I think I'm going to do wiggly lines on this, y'all. We're going to go wiggly here. Just like that. Still pretty wet. But it's okay. So we're doing wiggly. Wiggly. A inch flat tip brush. Oh, sorry, this is a three quarter inch flat tip brush. I some pink in that. Not letting it dry. See how this is starting to come on together. Please tell me it's not still looking like a pizza. Please. Is it just looking like a funky watermelon now? And not a pizza?
Oh, you're in the room, Trina. Thank you, Miss Pam. Hey, Janie. Hey, Courtney. And then I do, I think I want to put black white dots down the edge on this one. Trying to decide once I get it all done, I'm going to put gonna put happy summer on there. Then I'm gonna I think then I'm gonna decide if I want to do um some seeds. That's what's gonna make, really make it look like a watermelon, y'all. Those seeds. Okay. All right. How about that? this round on the slide away? Let me try to get this one more time because I got some pink in it. There we go. There we go. Okay. All right, so I have to let this dry. So let's give it a quick little dry with the blow dryer. Not to be bored with this question. So it's a little bit wetter than the other, but I'm going to try it. Okay, let me see. Let me find my good brush there. This one's broke. And it's all... I can still use it, though, and it kind of paint good. Let's try it, y'all. Okay, so that's not going to come out. Love how you drank your dew from a straw. Stop. Oh. I probably not drink it from a straw, to be honest. It just don't. I don't know. I think it's the can on my, my mouth or my lips, and I can't deal with it. Okay, so we're, we're going to end with this black, and we're just going to go around. Okay, our liner.
Oh Lord, I was about to get paint everywhere. I'm about to drip it everywhere. You'll see how funky that is. Okay, I see some spots. Let me go ahead and kind of go over a little bit more. Um, I can see right there. Then where I started, I see like where I started with more pain in my throat. Through here and just try to smooth those. Little parts out. Get off of there. Okay. Let's smooth this out. Thank you, Miss Mary. My hands are steady. Oh, Sonia, I clear. I feel like I was shaking. You just got sure hope so. What kind of wood do you, you usually use for your door hangers? Don't. I've been using the tripod, which I like, but my favorite wood, if I actually still did orders and shipped them, or when I was doing orders and shipped them, I used um, birch. <coughs> and the, um, I actually used the half inch birch, but like I use like a quarter inch tripod. Which is about the same thing as the Revolution plywood, and um, about the same thing as. Ooh, I said that my video got blurry. Why is your blur? And about the same thing as um, what you call it? Can't think of it. Like Luron. Yeah, my mouth went down the wrong way in this. <coughs> got me coughing, coughing. <coughs> Am I not going now? Because it's different to me. wonder if I go and it get back. Come on, thing. I ain't playing with you. It's almost like Facebook. So it's okay. This chick's been on long enough. Let me make the video crappy so everybody can get off. Okay, let's see if that hits. She just makes it look so easy. Oh, thank y'all so much. Okay, maybe it'll get better. I'm going to use the end of my sponge, and I'm going to do dots, dots around this, um, around the black here. I might have should have done it with, um, I did my hand lettering before I did this. So that's all I'm going to do and put little dots to make it even more fun. It's still blurry on my phone. So yes, yeah, so y'all in my that scoop. Um, like I was saying, if you just joining, you probably missed it. But I teach you two different door hangers a month. I provide you with the um, print template, and you get a tutorial on how to get those cut out using a so you get a tutorial on getting both of those designs painted, either both by me or either one and one by a guest you also get see me shaking you also get um we also do a graph together in there so i give you a supply list of all the paint colors you need for your door you get a supply list for all the stuff you need for the craft that we're doing uh we a zoom think tank in there as we get together on zoom and share our ideas for the next month 
talk about what we did the month before. So, so much fun. You are in a community of ladies that's creative and just all hyped up to learn. So you're all together in there and supportive and it's kind of like having your own little cheerleaders. Um, so the perfect way to make new best friends, especially at a time like this where we're all kind of stuck at home and can't get out and see our local friends. So it's good to have a community to kind of be right there along beside you. And there's so many here. There's so many girls in my inside scoop. Shows you step by step on making fingers from start to finish. <coughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Um, I'm getting hot up here too. I'll show you like how to add your hanger, how to seal it with your gloss. Uh, we got some bow tutorials in there. We've got a couple people in there that shows us hand lettering. Actually, Jessica was one of our guests um, a couple months ago. Um, we've had several silver. several um tell us to come in the group and just teach us. and it's just amazing so if y'all have any questions y'all ask away this is the cutest ever thank you so much sherry thank you beverly and miss peggy hey girl thank you bev mary and christine i think it's the where uh, probably is Miss Glenda, but I have like terrible sinuses, and my sinuses is always dry. And I got to come out and do just a minute ago, kind of like went down the hole. Mary says, Join the inside. We have so much fun. This is so worth the money. I promise. Miss Mary, you're amazing. Thank you so much. Is she like, Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Is she like beeping? And out, or is it just me? Sonia, so I'm that it was, and on my end right now, it, it is looking a little bit blurry. Hey, Sandy from Southern California. Uh, Miss Teresa says, I'm going to finish getting my business Facebook page set up this week. Can I possibly get you to critique it once I get it finished? I sure will, oh, Miss Teresa. I'm so glad that you said that. I'm going to let this dry a little bit, y'all. So what Ms. Teresa is asking about is I did a Facebook um, critiquing this April. Uh, we have different business, like, tutorial there. So this past month, April, we, um, I did show how to set up a Facebook business page. And the next day, I went in and I critiqued some of these business in there that wanted me to look at them and just gave them tips and tricks and and stuff like that so there's a good bit of business tips in there as well so it's like a a big old package all in one <laughs> where you get to learn create and get a lot of tips on the business side of it so yes the sound is cutting in and out i know Sandy, thank you so much. I know y'all, I'm so sorry. Why don't you pull my computer closer? Come here, y'all. All right, so let me blow dry this real quick. I 
At least the picture is clear. That's what matters, right? So I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna put Hey Summer on this. I'm right here. Let me see, I've got my holes here, so it's got to be centered this way. Thank you, Della. So I'm gonna do Summer here. I'm gonna make sure I'm not going crooked on my on me. Okay. And then I'm gonna do I'm just gonna do kind of like happy. Kind of all a little bit. So like that, I know y'all can't see that really good. Um, do you sell the cutout of the watermelon? Mert, I think I, they may have one on my website, but I'm not exactly sure. Um, but if you can message me, I'll check and I can add one on there. So I'm gonna use my you know possible pins. Thank you so much, Marilyn, for sprinkling. I appreciate that, love. Uh, do I sell the cutout of the watermelon? I do not. Not at this time, I don't. I wonder if I want to use this big enough. I think I'm going to use this big Posca. This is the size 7. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and do this first. Try not to get on my white, y'all, because it is still wet. Um, let me dry that real quick. These are the Costco paint pens. The website is trinaculatedesigns.com. Thank you, Mary. Fancy Scoop is a blast, and she has so much for prepared for us this next month. Jesse, thank you. Um, 
are amazing. I love y'all so much. So, so much. Hate pens literally hate my comments. Oh, Jessica, wow. Um, which I've been I've been using paint pens on my doors for kind of since I started, and that's been seven years ago. So um but I usually um use like the Walmart brand, the Walmart brand, but the painters pens from Walmart. Um the black one's pretty good. The white one, I could never find one that was quite good. But um, I've always used them. It's definitely different um than using a, I mean, yeah paint brush. Once you get the hang of them, oh my goodness, girlfriend. Jesse, thank you. Jesse has shared a link to the website, y'all, for the inside scoop. If you want to um, click on there and go ahead and join us in there. All right. Oh, it's still wet over there. <coughs> the sign I did recent. See, and you are doing, um, you have posted a good many of the, like, the actual wood signs lately. Y'all see my hand shaking? And, girl, those things look better than any you can buy from Hobby Lobby. I mean, y'all, my hand's literally, like, shaking. In my opinion, anyway, I think they're amazing. I uh, think you did amazing job. Uh, I thought I love y'all. The sign that I did really with a paint pen, it took me three hours to get through. Oh wow. What kind of paint pens are you using? Um Jessica, I'm trying to learn hand lettering and it's awful. Hoping it will get better. I mean, the thing about hand lettering is this you definitely definitely have to just practice. Big friend, my hand lettering is a hot mess and it's still not the best. I can tell you this. It is better now than it was a month ago. Now our friend Jessica Carpenter that's on here. She owns Country's Heaven Door. And um she's the bomb diggity bomb when it comes to hand lettering. Mine shake all the time. So you get see my my mind's like oh okay so let me give this a quick little dry so I don't get my black one out of my hair. Happy you know what though I got a lot of space left compared to this side. I think I'm gonna kind of make a full coming up like maybe here with my S and maybe that'll kind of bring it together okay that kind of helped I don't know if that was the best move ever but it kind of helped. All right, so let me do happy. Oh, 
Costco is like it will never keep paint flowing. That's why I keep on shaking it. And over here, I've got my plate. I keep on like pumping it to get it down to the bottom. Oh, I feel my paint stick right there. Why down a little bit more? I didn't. Oh well. Nothing I can do about it now. I'm gonna put a little syrup in here. Okay. Here's Happy Summer. Y'all see that? It says Happy Summer. Oh, Jessica, you're you're too sweet, girl. Okay, so I'm wondering, do I want to put, oh, look at there, and I've got it all over my shirt. Got, I knew I was going to do that, that not being wet, that not being wet yet. Y'all don't know this shirt tag on it. Let me try to get it off of my eyes. Got some baby wipes. All right, let me try to get it off of here. But I should it. I touched it. All right, now I fixed that later. Thank you, Jessica. Thank you, Melissa and Mary. Yes, but that was looking. I'm like the only person to the on the planet that saw at the paint pens. Just keep on practicing with Jessica um, because they, it, is, it, it is a lot different. But if you're good with a paintbrush, though, girl, you are amazing. <laughs> because I feel like it's harder than using a paint pen. Get that nine one proof alcohol on that shirt. Yeah, I got some downstairs. I need to just make sure it stays wet. Y'all let me know. Do y'all think I should put some watermelon seeds? Maybe like one here, one up here. Let's see. I'm going to use a little and kind of just see how I would like. Maybe a watermelon seed there. One there and maybe one there. Um... Maybe we could do a funky one there. Let's see, do we want to do one up here? How about if we did that? We like just spread them out. Um, this one needs to come. I think this one needs to come. This, this. Okay. These seeds. I think so too. So let's do some seeds. All right. Okay, I'm, I'm, gonna, do, I'm gonna do kind of a big one here. Oh. I'm gonna do kind of a small one there. And then let's do um, let's do one. I'm gonna get my bigger paint pen because that will take forever. Come with that one. Let's 
So you, you can paint pens. They feel in little things like this. Works perfectly fine. I think this is cute with like the little C's. I want the highlights in there too. Yes. Have y'all ever noticed I have to like, I get like right down on my work and y'all do that all the time. All the time, I had to like really day on over it <laughs> to do what I'm doing. That one kind of got happy and went kind of big, but I think it's good. So to see, does that look cute like that? Kind of funky looking. And I went white highlights, y'all. Um. <laughs> I don't even think I've used this one before. I haven't. Do those paint markers really work good? I like them. Um, I used and I still do use like some of the markers from Walmart. It's called painters pens, and I like those as well. Um. The only thing though is I have not yet like found a white that actually works enough for me to like to use. But the back I really, really like. Cute watermelon. A small over the P. Over the P. Like one right here. I can do that. I think. All right, I think it definitely needs one there. All right, so before I even forget, let's go ahead and let's put a small C. What maybe? Let's see. If I come, let's make that a little bit bigger. There we go. Right there. Did that kind of fill in that gap? Oh, thank you so much. So, see, is it? It's not looking like a piece of pizza, is it? I put it up a little closer. Y'all, this camera has me so oh. All right, we're not done. Yet. I'm fixing to add some more stuff and make it look like purdy. We're gonna make it look purdy. We're gonna use some tulip paint. Um. I'm going to use this tulip paint oiled on like my wiggle lines here. I'm going to use this white. To go in those seeds. that will be dry a little bit. So there's that. We're going to use this tulip paint and have a little fun with it. Thank y'all so much. 
maybe on number C. So we got six. I don't know where else I could put another. I might could put one like right here. I put one right there. You think? Um, I have a small one. So there's one right there. It's a small one, but we've got different size seeds anyway. What are you painting on? Just wood board. Yes, Robin, this is um, a piece of wood board that I cut out. Thank you, Shelly, Melissa. Wow, you wrote the words like a pro looks awesome. Oh, Debbie, thank you so much. Oh, girl, you speak in my language with tulip paint. Yes, Jessica. I like tulip paint. I used to use, when I like did custom orders and stuff, when I was on Etsy, I used glitter paint. It was going out of style. I used to love some glitter paint. But I don't hardly ever use glitter paint anymore. And I kind of miss it. I wish I could, wish I use a little bit more. Because glitter paint is so awesome, y'all. We're going to come and we're just going to go around all the blue lines here. It'll give it a little pop with some tulip paint, which back in the day we would probably call this puffy paint. So if you're wondering what tulip paint is, they actually use this to like put on t shirts and we used to uh, like decorate the little um, conferences. This. All right, I'm going to go around my seeds with this, y'all. This is just going to give it some more whimsy. And if you know too much, it gives your stuff a little bit of texture. So that's always fun, right, to have texture. Um, now I'm going to grab up my water. White tulip paint. Me, Jessica, I did too. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate all of them. I'm just going to come and I'm going to put two wiggly lines down here on my green. Because I just want a little bit of extra. I'm going to put that white one right there. Now I'm going to comb my tulip paint with this and put it there. Um, I feel like my my paint circles need something, y'all. Do y'all think my paint circles need anything? Thank you, Tam. Yeah, my pink circles need anything like shit. I put like just a little bit of white on some of them to a paint. Tell you what, let's try it real quick. If I don't like it, I will wipe it really quick. Oh, yeah, I'm going with that. That gives it more of the wind look that, I, that I'm going for. And then I think this is going to finish it up, ladies. I think it's going to be finished. Put on circles. I just put something on circles. Okay, y'all tell me. Oop. And I'm here right again. So I did put some circles, just a little bit of white. So I see it right there. Ugh. I'll get this camera straight. And I'm done. I am 
done. Looks great. Yep, super whimsy. Mm. All right, ladies. I'm going to lift this camera up. I'm going to try to lift up. There we go. <coughs> okay. So this is it. I'm going to get you kind of close. Maybe y'all can see it. I warped up with this camera. All right. I think it turned out really cute. Yeah, I'm so warped up. If I have other things, there we go. It's straight now. There we go. So, if you have any questions about my inside scoop, be sure to comment or message me. Or you can go to trendesign.com, click on that in tab, and and read um, what all you get for the $37 a month. Remember, I will not hold you in there anytime that you get ready. So, but it's super fun, y'all. And it's an amazing group of ladies in there that is just, just simply, I can't say anything else besides they are amazing. So be part of a community. You will love, love, love you back. Enjoy my inside scoop. I will probably see you guys on tomorrow. Tomorrow is the cut -off there won't be any more sign ups for the Monday after tomorrow. So be sure to join if you want to join. And if not, that's okay too. Y'all just come on here and chit chat with me, and that helps me out just as much. And I appreciate that just as much. So I love you no matter what. Thank y'all for sticking with me. And um, thank y'all so much. I will see y'all again tomorrow, y'all. Good night. See if I can work it. All right, end of the video.